Today, I will be beating Blocks Fruits on a typewriter. So you saw in the previous challenge where we reached max level while staying in a single island. If you haven't seen it yet, pause this video right now and go check that one out first. But reaching max level is not enough. We must also beat the game by defeating the four pillars of Blocks Fruits. And I mean Dark Beard, Second Siindra, Third Siindra, and of course the Doe King. Not only are these the most difficult bosses in the game, they're also the most rare, requiring a bunch of mini quests and special items just to summon them. And today, we do them all while using a typewriter. Yeah, it's gonna be our hardest challenge yet because this thing's not really designed for gaming, so we're gonna have to see how it turns out. Uh, now, for the most of you guys who are not as old as me, you might not know what a typewriter is, which is totally understandable, but you should be young enough to know what Google is, so look it up. Code in you. So new setup for the purposes of today's video, I put my camera so that you could see my keyboard and screen at the same time, just to prove to you that I'm not cheating. Let's get the show on the road. I won't be looking at the camera a lot uh, because it's, it's just gonna make my head dizzy. So I apologize in advance. We can finally leave this island. Oh, it's been so long. Wait, I don't have the I don't have the game passes. Damn it. Okay, we're, we just have to buy a cheap boat. Uh, all right, here we go. Riding on a basic boat like a peasant. Hopefully this doesn't reduce the chances of me spawning a sea beast. Right off the bat, this keyboard is very hard to use. I got my squad here, Marley, Ice Pig, and Indeed. They're gonna help me find some sea beasts. Where are they? I got a pizza here. Bruh, no way. Yo, sea beast on me. On me, hurry. I must fight back. They only have combat and a Buddha. I only have the one move, guys. This is going to take a forever. Do you guys hear how loud this mechanical keyboard sounds? It sounds fantastic, but it also kind of is distracting. Hey, that was quick. No fist, no fist. Okay, none of us got fist. Much, much, much later. You hit the wrong house, fool. Back up. <laughs> got him. Oh, this is like the third boat. They <laughs> killed me, too. They sunk my boat. And killed me. I'm ready to. I'm this close to giving up, and we're not even done our first challenge yet. You guys hear that? Yeah, you like that keyboard ASMR, eh? I know, I know. You're all thinking the same thing. And you, where did you get this beautiful LED lid retro multi device mechanical typewriter keyboard? Or this lightweight handheld portable gaming console with 360 plus retro games? Or this beautiful wireless controller that is compatible with console, PC, and mobile devices? I don't usually let you guys in on a lot of secrets, but I'm in a good mood today, so I'll let you know. Timu, say it with me now. Timu. Timu is a place where you can get all your gaming accessories for cheap with high quality and fast with an endless catalog of gadgets to choose from, including a Nintendo Switch. We'll talk about that in a minute. If you're a true gamer on a budget, this is the place for you. But hey, maybe you're not in the mood for gaming. That's fine. Whatever you need, Timu has got you. There are various categories to choose from, such as clothing, electronics, jewelry, and household supplies. Basically, whatever you need, you'll find it on Timu. Hell, maybe you'll find some things you didn't know that you needed till today. Like this nose and hair trimmer for only $2.69? Definitely buying that. Ah, but and you, why would I use Timu when there are countless of other websites I could buy things from? Well, can you get this dope looking iPhone phone case for only $2.68 with free shipping on other websites? I rest my case. Get it? iPhone case, I rest my case stupid once you get the phone case as soon as like this week you can join the millions of others by downloading the timu app on your phone now and start shopping today and don't forget to use my link and code in the description below to sign up for an account to get up to a hundred dollars in coupons and sales on select items up to 90 percent they're practically giving this stuff away. Now, back to the Switch. You can now purchase a Nintendo Switch OLED model on Timu for only $2.99 or as low as $2.54 if you use the coupons when you sign up with my link or code. For comparison, they're usually like $320 on Timu or like $350 or more elsewhere. So what are you waiting for? Get on that right now. Or like right after this video. Oh, here we go. I feel like we waited half an hour for this one. This has got to be the fist. Oh, the buttons are so hard to press. Ah. <sighs> NF, NF. I'm, I assume that means no fist and nothing. Why is this so tough? Yo, another one just spawned. It's been like 30 seconds. What the hell? I don't get this, man. These CBs spawn like a public bus schedules, meaning they don't have schedules. What's wait, up? wait, wait. There are two? 
Guys, I swear, this is just like the public transit system of my city. You wait 40 minutes for a bus and nothing comes, and all of a sudden, four pile up. All right, no fist. I did earn one level. What are you talking about? Nope. Still no fist? Are we about to fail this challenge before even starting? 346 minutes later. More ship battle. More ship battle. No CB's battle. There are big ships and there are small ships, but there's nothing like friendships. That was cringe as hell, man. I'm just, I'm going crazy. At this point, guys, I honestly think it's probably easier to find the One Piece than the Fist of Darkness. Oh my God, bro. Oh, hell. I'm not even, I'm not even gonna react to it because that's what they want to see, okay? You ain't getting no reaction out of me. See? Didn't even blink an eye. This has got to be it. Please, for the love, if there is any hope in this world, please send me a sign. Please, please tell me you got it. Yes! Yes! Marley! Oh my god! Thank you! Oh, bro, hurry. Summon him. Don't ask questions, just go. What? Let him solo? No! All right, you know what? You know, okay, I'll try to do it myself. I'm not a coward and you never backs down from a challenge. I'm the king of the M1 spam, boy. You know what? I just totally forgot that I'm max level, so this shouldn't really be that hard. The only thing that's keeping me from doing this is my finger constantly pressing the wrong button here because the keyboard is so damn small. Give me my goddamn milk. Ah! All right, he's almost dead. Looks like I can solo this. Should be more confident in myself in the future. The combat is unstoppable. I can't lose. It's not possible! Uh, uh, no dark cold. We did get some frags, which is good. Dark fragment, very nice. Challenge number one is complete. All right, so we finally killed Darkbeard after um, three hours. Now we're gonna move on to reaching the third C by killing the first RIP Indra. Let's get into it. You guys hearing this? Here how fast I'm clicking my button. Wait, um... Hmm? What am I supposed to do? I can't remember. Okay, so apparently I didn't do the Bartolo quest, which will allow me to unlock those gates. So I gotta do this quest. Here we go. Go now. Free the imprisoned gladiators who are jailed. How do I free these guards? I feel like I have to do something with these symbols. Yeah, look, the, the symbol just changed color. I, I gotta do it in a specific order. Oh, I know where it is. It's in Swan's house. Aha, uh -huh, see? Hey, my memory serves me correct. Hey, and we got the warrior's helmet and the champion. I'm busy right now. Come back when you've reached a level 1500 and defeated Don Swan. I have not defeated Don Swan. What have I been doing? All right, pal. You're just another obstacle between me and the thirsty. I must end this quick. All right, Don Swan, second form. Uh, still easy, if you ask me. All right, I'll do this. I'll do this with my eyes closed. Is he dead? <gasps> See, easy. <laughs> Can you go disrespect R.I.P. Indra for me? That's that's my favorite thing to do. Get me over there. Part two of our challenge begins. What's Indra to a god? I'm the ultimate awakened Buddha. You can't hurt me, bro. I'm level twenty four fifty. This should be a piece of cake. What the hell? Oh, guys. The infamous cutscene. Should we watch this? Should we watch this? We've all seen it. Let's skip this. Let's head to the third C. Finally. Boys. Oh, we made it. It's not like... All right, it's not that exciting. So for the next part of this challenge, we must defeat R.I.P. Indra, which means we must obtain a God's Chalice. Now the server hasn't been up for four hours yet, so um, we gotta wait for elite hunters to spawn and hopefully our luck is a lot better this time. <laughs> Good one. All right, looks like we got our first elite hunter uh, near floating turtle. I cannot access the port. You've gotta be joking. I literally asked Celix to trade a, a, a portal fruit to me and this dude just gifted me a perm. Thank you. I wanted to get the portal fruit so I could travel easier to find these elite hunters, but uh, yeah, looks like I got the perm now. That's nice. Only problem is, I have no mastery. 
So I gotta go farm some. Let's do this. So my plan is to uh, hit up Big Mom with my Buddha and then switch to Portal last second. See if it works. I mean, we got some time to kill since uh, since we're waiting for the next Elite Hunter to spawn. Might as well farm for some mastery. After killing Law, Darkbeard, and Indra, a Big Mom's kind of easy. I'm not even gonna lie. Ah! Hey, hey, hey! Should be a lot of mastery for this. Oh my god. <laughs> Bro. Y'all seeing this? We're about to get 200 right now. Oh, 154. God damn. Guys, I don't want you to think that this is a bad keyboard by any means. It's just, it's not designed for gaming, obviously. It's a little tough when you're button mashing the whole time. So, and that's what I'm doing. If you were using it, for example, to write essays, like a nerd, then you wouldn't probably, you wouldn't have any problems. Yes! Yes! We did it! Okay, 217. We're good to go. Uh, let's world warp back on out of here. Sea castle, baby. We should have an elite now. Urban roaming around a floating turtle. Oh, there they are. All right, boys. Let's get it. Let's hope this is the chalice. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, my God. I hope, I hope I'm dealing enough damage. These guys are killing it too fast. No. Pirate raid on the castle while we wait for this... The elite hunter you know the good thing about elite hunters is we know that one spawns at least once every 10 minutes compared to cbs where you just you literally you just gotta wait could be 10 minutes could be 10 seconds could be 10 hours i don't know the frequency of how fast they spawn hydra hydra oh my fingers on fire we gotta do this quick i gotta amputate it after this video let me get him let me at him let me at him. Better give me this damn chalice, bro. I swear. Stop. Let me go. Any luck? Any luck? W? L. <laughs> All right. While we wait for the elite hunter, let's. why don't we grind for some cocoa so that we can get the chocolate chalice, whatever the hell it's called, uh, to kill the Doe King later. I think we just need like 10 of them, maybe. Conjured cocoa. All right. There's one. Well, they seem to be pretty rare, eh? Damn, they're hard to... They're hard to obtain. Damn. No cocoa. Wow. These cocoa puffs are hard to get. Am I allowed to start the quest where uh, where we kill like uh, like 500 NPCs? We still need to, uh, 420 more. Oh, we've already killed 80? Wait, does those NPCs count over there? Let me see uh, once Selix kills some more if it goes down. Okay, so looks like Selix killing them doesn't count. So somebody must have already started this prerequisite i'm gonna continue we're gonna kill 500 of these npcs so we could eventually summon the doe king after we kill indra serious grinding montage oh it's so painful must fight through the pain must endure must persevere i'm talking about my finger by the way not the grind the grind yeah the grind is also the grind sucks Okay, good news. Selix got 10 cocoa, it looks like. So we're ready to get the chocolate chalice. Let's see how much progress we've made on these NPCs. Fight! 352. I'm out. Alright, so the good news is we did kill enough NPCs and also have enough Cocos in order to summon the Doe King. The bad news is we don't have a chalice and I have no idea when we're gonna get it. And we need two! We haven't even killed Indra yet. So the only things left to do is pray we get a chalice from an elite hunter or maybe the server's been up for four hours and uh, we could find one from the chest. Regardless, we'll be back when we finally find our first chalice. So the server's been up for four hours and the squad is going around opening chests uh, for the chalice. Wish us luck. Nope. Nope. If 
few moments later. So it hadn't been four hours earlier when we were looking for the chest, but now it has. And Eren just found the chalice, and we're finally gonna be able to kill Indra. I feel like I'm in a dream because uh, it doesn't even feel real. All right, look at the look at the squad, bro. Oh my god. I want to take a sip out of that delicious... What is that? Blood? Or is that poop? That looks like diarrhea, guys. Get over here! Ah! Yes, Indra, we meet again. I've been waiting for five hours to try to kill you. And it hasn't even been five seconds and my fingers are already in pain, dude. I think uh, I'm definitely getting some permanent injuries from this. But totally worth it for the video. Drop a like, guys. For my broken finger. Wait, 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 bro. Oh... Yo, he's already at half health? Holy... We're killing this. Guys, the saddest thing just happened to us. Right before we killed Indra, my computer ran out of space. The recording ended, but hey, I have evidence. We got Shadow Sovereign, and that's the title that you get from defeating R.I.P. Indra True Form. So we did kill him, but I couldn't catch it on tape. Bro, this whole day has been a total L. But we will consider this challenge complete. Let's go ahead and try to find the next challenge to summon the Doe King. It's gonna be another like five hours. I can't believe this. And if that wasn't enough evidence for you, here we also got the Valkyrie helmet, okay? We did defeat Indra. I apologize for not showing it to you guys. I, I need to I need to expand my hard drive space. I think that's that's the lesson that we learned here today. But here's a recreation of basically what happened. Take a look. All right, guys, so we waited like for three or four more elites and still no chalice, okay? I'm not even surprised anymore at this point, but it is 3 a.m. in the morning and uh, I got to get up early tomorrow. So I'm going to go to sleep for now and uh, we'll pick it back up tomorrow. Ah, so it is the next day and we've had the server up for like, I don't even know how many hours. And uh, Cash just found a chalice from the chest because there is no way of getting it from an elite as we have just proved it. So we're gonna have to kill more NPCs though because the previous server, uh, my internet bailed on me. All right, the previous server disconnected. So let's go ahead and do that and then we'll get to killing the Doe King. We got the squad already working on it. We're gonna go help him out. My finger did recover slightly. It's feeling a lot better. Uh, I'm, I'm getting used to this more and more as we use it. So uh, feeling all right so far. Uh, we got a stack team going into this so I'm not worried about killing the Doe King. It should be a piece of cake. Oh, we're about to get 500 kills in no time. This is so fast. Alright, so we did kill enough NPCs and we're ready to summon the Doe King. I've been waiting for this moment for like the last 24 hours. Finally, it's about to come. We're walking up menacingly to the Doe King. Let's go, boys! The final stage. The grand finale. I know what you guys are thinking. Uh, there's no way in hell I'm gonna try to solo the Doe King with combat because the combat is too powerful. Yeah, it wouldn't it wouldn't be fair. So I'm gonna get these guys to do some damage too, you know? Man, I can't imagine having to do combos with this keyboard. It'd be really, really tough. Oh, we're close. I've barely taken any damage. Does Doe King give any mastery? I'm gonna try to use uh, my Devil Fruit ability to get the last hit, you know? Okay, no mastery. We got Spiky Trident and Pale Scarf. Easy. Big dub for your boy. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Let's go. Look at me. All right, boys. Uh, with 24 hours of grinding, blood, sweat, tears, maybe a little bit of pee, we finally completed the last challenge and officially beaten Blocks Roots. It feels good to do it for the second time over again. Well, there you have it, everybody. After 24 excruciatingly long hours, we finally completed the four challenges and defeated Blocks Fruit. So give ourselves a pat on the back. We earned it. If you did enjoy the video, of course, don't forget to drop a like. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. Turn on the post notifications if you like content such as this. In the meantime, join the Discord server along with my socials. All of that is in the description. And uh, I'm, I'm going to go back to sleep. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.